Hollywood created its legend off the western, and without doubt one of the best TV westerns there ever was was Big Valley. I would have to say the best goes to Gunsmoke. But Big Valley had its virtue. Of course, it had some problems too, mostly the fact that it was a strong female lead. A lot of folks weren't quite ready for that just yet, but Barbara Stanwyck pulled it off beautifully. And still to this day, I would have to say, next to Gunsmoke, it's the best Western, at least on television, there ever was. Independent filmmaking has never been more challenging than it is today. Although there's still money available, uh, it's pretty well dried up for big budget independent films. For those of us who have dreams of shooting a big budget independent film, you're going to have to learn to do a lot of that yourself. That means pulling cable, that means setting audio, doing lights, everything by yourself. got some difficult days ahead but it really doesn't matter with me now because I've been to the mountaintop and I don't mind like anybody I would like to live a long life longevity has its place but I'm not concerned about the death of Troy Davis is living proof that the justice system is dysfunctional. It needs to be accountable both to itself as well as the people, not to mention the Constitution. With Occupy Wall Street growing more and more every day, the Republicans are going to find themselves faced with a very, very serious question. Is the Tea Party actually worth it? I think in the end they're going to find they're not. I see here in Washington things are getting pretty live with Occupy Wall Street. Evidently the people have decided they've had quite enough. If you think it's going to go away, think again. It's going to grow. All across America, Americans are gathering and exercising their right to peaceful assembly and free speech. They want the nation back. They're concerned about politicians who seem to have their own agenda in mind. Indeed, they want their country back. Israel's got a big problem with Netanyahu and Lieberman. Those two are going to lead that nation into total destruction. And I think a good many of the Israelis know that. Now what they do with those two is up to them. But whatever they decide, they'd better make it quick while there still is in Israel. North Korea is another area that has a very possible solution. I think the biggest problem there is agitation, mostly by the United States, in order to promote conflict so that they can continue to sell arms to both sides. I think all that's really necessary right there is for both sides to decide that they actually want peace. I see Jimmy Hoff is about ready to go kick some ass. <laughs> Actually, that's not a bad idea, but the title's not right. But there are times when something like that is just what the doctor ordered. 